everyone. Happy New Year, by the way. So um, just to keep you an update on the Escobar Inc. Uh, email reply, as you can see from here, I said, Dear Escobar Inc., as you know, there was some uncertainty about what they replied back to me. But I just say thank you for your reply. I wasn't asking for a free sample, as you know. Um, but since I am one of the purchasers, I was hoping to obtain an Escobar for one early. Uh, than others so that I can convince others that you are genuine because as you know many people are saying that they are scam uh, we we don't know yet it's quite clear that they said it's gonna be by end of January it's also the article saying that it's gonna be by January and etc anyway just to keep you updated I also want to share the email contact reply that I got from you by the way Escobar uh, Inc has been from my personal experience they have promised that they're going to come back to me within 48 hours. There was a Christmas time which took them about three days to come back to me, but they have been consistent with their promise. Um, and uh, they said to me as follows, um, understood, uh, sorry, we just got get thousands of requests, not a surprise, for free samples or people claiming to be reviewers just like me, to jump in uh, to the line, so to speak. So you can imagine a lot of people will say, free sample, free sample, free sample, free sample or earlier, earlier, earlier purchase, blah, blah, blah. But anyway, each order, this is the one I want to highlight. So each order is shipped by a one by one in a way it came in. So I think what they mean is as one is ready to be shipped, they will be sending up by post and so on. It would, be, it would cost us more money than our margins to single out packages uh, as like asking for free sampling etc um, and send them with an express service like DHA for example I don't want you guys to send DHL as you know I'm pretty much anti DHL they don't even bother um, sending it back to even up to our flat anyway so th those are the things so happy new year 2020 is going to be a strong year for Escobar phones so that's the thing I want to share with you okay now um, one of the uh, kind lady actually, I think she's called Pam Diana Fun. She said, hi there, here's some updated news on Pablo Escobar folding phone um, after reading the news, news article on CNET website. I do believe phone is real. Hopefully we will be shipping out, um, they will be shipping out them shortly. Uh, here are the links in the news of article. Please read it and let us know what you think. By the way, I just subscribed to your channel. Thank you very much for subscribing to my channel, by the way. Right, so this link is about the unbelievable $350 Escobar Fold phone won't appear on CES 2020. Um, and um, I recommend you guys to read this. But the main thing is that uh, the Fold one considerably cheaper uh, than Motorola 1500 and Samsung's 1980 uh, Galaxy Fold and 2400 US dollars Huawei Mate X. And I think that's probably why um, I think this com these companies like Motorola, Razer, Samsung, and Huawei, um, they somehow use their muscle power to make sure that Escobar Inc. Uh, cannot appear on to the CES 2020. But you can see that Escobar uh, company is willing to show that they, that, that they are genuine, while as all these big players, we all know that it's the same design as uh, the uh, Royal uh, Flexi Pal, by the way, but anyway, um, but all these big tech company are using their muscle somehow that they will not be shown on the uh, CES 2020 event, which is quite a shame actually, because I thought there was a fair game and trade and etc. Um, but um, it's one of the, one of those articles yet again to convince you. Even CNET is highlighting it, and they're aware that Escobar um, Inc has been muscled out with this event of 2020. So what do you think? Do you think um, still the Escobar Inc is a scam? Because um, I don't. I mean, they have come back to me with all their emails reply within 48 hours as they promised, other than the fact that it was Christmas time, uh, they, were, they were slightly late, um, and all these articles uh, and their constant email replies that my viewers are sending to me is consistent, and they are promised with this January uh, deadline. Um, so I'm expecting, ho hopefully, that I'll get the phone by late uh, January or worst case scenario, somehow we'll mid or f mid or early February. Who cares? I mean, as long as I get it within that certain time period, I think it's a very reasonable price and approach. 
Uh, so I just want to. S- I'm really glad overall, by the way, that um, Escobar Inc is not going to send my goods through DHL. They are completely useless. Um, I, I made a video about it as well. So, you, you, but anyway, so I'm very excited about this Escobar Fold Inc. Um, a proper gold foldable next generation phone and also I hope that from their cheap price approach will give these big players a hard time saying listen you're overpricing all your products you've got to be really reasonable with their price this is something that I want to rebel against as well just because it's a new product doesn't mean that it has to always have to start with a really expensive price um, and I think Escobar Inc is trying to tell us that um, through this competitive price Certainly all these big tech firms can reason out with their overpriced tag with their products as well. That's the story about it. So let's see how it goes. Anyway, so thank you very much for watching this video. This is LGB Tech and I hope you have a nice remaining weekend. All the best. Bye-bye.